Welcome back guys, how you all doing? My name is Marks, this is Markscraft, and today we're starting our new project. See you all there. Alright guys, so between episodes on a live stream, I have cleared out this section of forest just here, ready for the next project we're going to work on uh, maybe a little bit more i need to do but we'll get to that at some point so i do need to plan out the entire city here um because that's what this project is it's going to be the first big city it's going to be like an overflow from the main trade place over there um or if you don't quite want to go there you just visit this place kind of like a well, yeah, an overflow. I already said it. Um, so yeah, that's what this place is going to be. Now, as I've done with the others, I need to go around and plan out where bits and bobs are going to go. But for this episode, we are not going to do that. Um, because I know exactly what is going where that torch is just there. So that torch, I want, uh, I want, um, that torch is bang central with um, the bridge just here. Okay, uh, with the bridge just here. So essentially we can have a straight path from them. Now this is going to be the very edge of the city here. I don't mind the floating leaves. I needed some acacia and that's why I got them. Um, so yeah, this is going to be the very edge of this side of it. Um, now this central bit is three, seven wide. No, nine wide. Get it right. So yeah, it's nine wide. And it is going to be seven deep, I think I said. And by I think I said, I mean to myself. Uh, so let's see, it's three, six, seven. Oh, wait, no, that's not right. So it needs to be here, doesn't it? So this is just the template for it. Five, six, seven, eight, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep, I plugged. There we go. So this is the center of our gatehouse. So this will be where the portcullis sit. Not the port yeah, the portcullis kind of thing just the entrance sits then these are either side four five six seven are going to be seven by seven so it gives us a five by five internal area now this side is gonna be basically dead i do it like a, a little guard oh wait no this side's the full side this side's gonna be the dead side, but I might put like a, a little guard station in it. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ooh, can't place. Right, yep. Yeah. So that is that. And then we've got the port colors in the middle. And this is gonna go up here. With then on this side going to have so it's going to be external like that and then totally didn't die because i had to go and look after the dog for a second totally didn't happen did not happen yeah so the other side um right so we've got so these are seven by seven with a nine by nine outer 
booze it, which is literally just that. Then off this front one. Five, six, seven. We've got another one. And a mark couple. No, I need more. And so here we go. So, there we go. That's back from my original mine underneath there. Come on. Over we go. So then. This here would be no, that's wrong. Ignore me. We're not coming out there. It's got the tower three, four, five, six here. Oh, spooder. And it comes off that this way. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. This it can be fun to try and sleep. Oh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There, which means the tree's in the way, or some sauce. That means we've got another tree to take down. All right, let's sleep, and, and then we can. Hopefully, we can. Yeah, should be able to. Right, slip time. And we'll look at the footprint or foundations of this guy. Spider's dead. Everything else is dying. So this is the reverse side of it. This would be the back. The front is this side. So, yeah, this would be like the, the actual gatehouse. And then like a little guard thing here um, and we've got the bridge over the top so it's going to be ah a skeleton yeah it's going to be the downstairs of this bit is only going to be in these three all right yep that could essentially be a double Pull it. I don't know. So yeah. Um. So house. Like an entrance. Tower. It'll go up to the second floor where we'll also have the cross bit and we'll come across over this bit. Uh, and this downstairs bit will just be like a an office or something for. I don't know toll payment. Guards, something like that. Let's just clear this. No, just this side. Because it's weird seeing it that way. And uh, yeah, it should be pretty big when it's done in terms of its overall footprint. So I am going to jump onto the camera account and get this guy into a time lapse because it's gonna take a while so i'll see you guys once that's done back in a minute
Right, so that time lapse did not go as planned. Um, I kind of changed the dimensions a little bit, so it threw me off, which is why I had to end where I did. However, we still finished it. So, I have obviously, I only got to kind of that bit and none of the back was done on the time lapse and none of the side was detailed or anything um, and yeah I've just gone around probably do with some more stuff on that side but no mad uh, I've just gone around and um, thrown in some some detail bits there's probably going to be a stable or something coming off this bit so I didn't put anything there not on the end there it's going to be the wall going out and around for the city go away so this is our first building for the new project and it is our I can't say little because it's, it's not um, but this is our gay house there's a cobweb there a string and um, yeah, but not only that, no, it's this side. It's also a house. Actually, a pretty big house, to be fair. I mean, if it's got three stories here and then all this space over the top. So, you know, whoever lives here is lucky. they got a lot of space. Lots and lots of space. And now let's throw shaders on and see how it looks in that. Let's get back up here. For a nice vantage point and get those shaders on and here it is with dope oh. damn it <laughs> here it is with the, with the shaders on so and these are um silders vibrant uh, in case anyone was wondering uh, and it does just look great I just want to thank Summer B as well for his suggestions with this bit here. I initially did it as a hit proof and it kind of looked janky and weird. Um, and he suggested just changing it up. And I'd kind of been at it a few hours when, when I did that and it said a fresh eyes help. So thank you very much Summer B for, for your suggestion there. Um, but yeah, this is, this is it. As I said, with them, um, I've been round and, and textured everything, so we've got the prep bricks and mossy bricks in in the walls, and then for the roof, we've got some stripped acacia with the terracotta. Uh, I've put in a little bit of pathway here, a bit more stone than I've done previously over that way, because we're getting closer to like a, a main city, so this will transition into actual stone going up there and then it's like pure stone um, and I'll probably do like the, a messier stone around here as well let me know what you think guys it's uh, it's taken a while to get this up much much easier in creative I'm not gonna lie it probably took an hour or so in creative and much much longer in survival and um, and i kept having to go back and check and make sure i was doing the right things and i changed up certain bits and yeah but let me know what you think uh, but that's going to be it for today's episode guys uh, thanks for watching and i'll see you all next time Jeff for now bye bye <laughs>